What's going on guys? Today we are testing out a new bait and it is Suki Bait by Danny King. While I was out in Possum Kingdom, Texas, I got to meet Danny King and his family and they're a real nice bunch of people and I picked up the Suki Bait to test it out in my waters over here so that's exactly what we're going to do today. I'm going to put it up against just regular night crawlers. We're going to do some fishing for channel cats and hopefully we'll get on some. So. Let's get this rigged up. I got my rods already ready to go. I'm gonna put some bait on them. This bigger rod here, we're gonna do the Suki bait. Check it out, guys. Big old tub of Suki bait. I think it's seven pounds. So it's made with chicken gizzards. Yep, I can, there's that gizzard right there. Chicken gizzards are really tough, so they shouldn't fall off the hook at all. Should be on there quite well. There it is. So I'm gonna launch this one out there. And let's get this smaller rod. This is my bait rod, guys. I'll be putting night crawlers on it. This rod's been beat to heck, man. <laughs> the tip been broken off. I replaced that. Then, uh, snapped it in half put it together with some electrical tape but she's still holding on so i'm gonna put some night crawlers on there yeah we'll do one hooks aren't too big i don't expect anything super big out of here Little night crawler. Let's get that out there. Now it's just a waiting game guys, let's see if we can get on a fish. While we're waiting for a bite guys, let me show you this bait. It's not just chicken gizzards, it's, it's a mixture of different stuff here and it's got... It's got fiber mixed into it so you could easily use it like a punch bait. Just dip a treble hook in there with a stick, pack it on there and See how thick that stuff comes out and you'd be good to go. But it does have chunks of chicken gizzard and other things in here that are solid chunks that you could hook onto a just a single hook. So this is a pretty pretty good setup that old Danny's got going here. Um I'm, I'm digging it. <laughs> In a nibble on the suki. Oh, 
Get a bite on that suki, guys. There you go, guys. Check that guy out. A little fishing with the Suki bait from old Danny King, and it it's producing. Look at that. Nice. <laughs> nice little channel cat, huh? Like that old Suki bait, huh? Get you on the hook too. See, that's that gizzard, chicken gizzard that's on there with that special mixture concoction he's got going on. They was right on the hook. I got a buddy I promised some fish to, so I'm gonna take this to him. Get this guy on a stringer. Get that bait back out there, guys. Still good. See if we can get another one. Yeah, he's just a nibbler. It's starting to warm up out here. It was cool this morning. What is this? Much better. There you go guys, another one. Got me while I was putting my waders back on. I found that Suki bait. <laughs> That's cool, this one's in the moss a little bit, huh? That's pretty cool, they haven't even touched the worms. Pretty interesting. Nice channel cat. Perfect eating size. All right. Now I can finish getting dressed here. <laughs> All right, that's two on the Suki bait. Zero on worms. Go figure, huh?
Oh, Danny King's got a good bait here, guys. That bait, still tough on there. Well, guys, we're running out of time. We did all right. We caught a couple of fish, some nice channel cats. We caught it on the on the Suki bait by Danny King. I was very pleased with it. Uh, it outfished worms, like I said. So, if you guys are interested, I'll put the link in the description below. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.